Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to A Young Fire. My name is Demita WMJ and thank you so much for joining me for today's video. Right here on A Young Fire, I actually realized I got to the airport, sat down, have had coffee, drank water, and I was like, I actually didn't greet. I actually didn't greet and that is bad manner. So I am here to greet and say good morning officially. Um, you guys are coming with us to Cape Town. I would have said, please guess where we are going, but I'm sure that you are going to see on the title of the video where we are going, so that wasn't really going to work. So in today's video, I am going to be showing you guys um, our trip to Cape Town. It's still our birthday month, um, so I'm with Lebo. So let me show you. Hello, Cape Town, here we are. <laughs> loading, loading, loading. Ooh. So, ooh, the battery's low. Oh my god. Okay, I'm charging now the battery as we're sitting in the lounge because, wow, your brother forgot to charge his, um, his batteries. In fact, I didn't forget. I was sleeping and I was like, I'm not waking up to go charge batteries. I will charge them tomorrow. Anyway, we are here. Let me, let me finish quickly. So, if you haven't subscribed, please do ensure that you subscribe. Hit the subscribe button, the notification bell. Listen, you guys ask for vlogs. I'm giving you vlogs. So, share this video with your friends. Like, take the link. Right, take the link, put it on your WhatsApp story, and then come back and watch the rest of the vlog. I'll see you guys now. <laughs> Not us getting airport announcements. Now I'm like, is it, did you feel it? I was like, yeah. I like, I'm down. my city so Not us having to run for our flight because of how. The video are mostly long man. More way less say. Yeah, I think so. Can now. Good, thank you. No. Are you safe? Imagine missing the. You can see on the system. Thank you. Hey, <laughs> wow. at um, 117 Strand which is where we're going to be staying um, really really nice hood I like it one of the other things I like is that it's right across one of the places that I really like which is Utopia Bar that's at the capital um, close to Burka the waterfront so it's like very central so we are staying here Leo just went inside to go get parking tickets and sort out the admin so when we are done we're gonna park and then we are going to live our lives <laughs> i'm learning how to do um tours like apartment tours and all of those things um once once i know how to do it like really better uh well the more i do it let me rather say the more i do it the more i think i get better at it so i'm gonna keep doing those for you you guys enjoy them and then yeah so just waiting for them to finish this car's hot so we just got to the place where we're going to be living for the next couple of days for the next week and 
absolutely amazing love it love it love it love it it looks like a place i would live in permanently <laughs> like a person who i styled it decorated it whatever you call it really really has my heart um really subtle things that i like some things i would have changed but i absolutely love it absolutely love it um the view is amazing the view is beautiful um it's it's one of those spaces man like it's not huge but it's functional and it's pretty and it's it's beautiful so yeah i'm going to show you guys around so that you guys can hala and sabawela <laughs> okay this is beautiful oh absolutely gorgeous Let me take you guys upstairs. All right. Okay. Good morning. It's not morning, but you know what I mean. Ah, uh, fam. I could live like this. Sure. Glass finishes. Absolutely love how this place looks. Look at me. This is the bathroom. Shower. So we just got to Bangalore Beach for Sundowners. I wanna read the Chiscopo Dilen Dile. So the colour space. Koba Sirasi Reta isn't as a colour. Isn't as a overseas international thing like a very shapile guy of name. Sure, I think one of the things that I like about this place is this view. Do you think it's going to show with the sunlight? Mm, no, deaths. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Especially this time. This time of the day really is the best time for Tai. Don't have sorry, we don't have anything. Yeah. The sun is about to set. We got so annoyed we got here. I don't know if you guys are gonna hear me because of the sound. Because the speaker's right here. But we got so annoyed when we got here because people the people that paid their bills and were ready to leave still haven't left. They were hanging. <laughs> like chandeliers. I mean <laughs> If you pay, if you pay, leave. <laughs> Move for others. It's a system, this thing. They probably don't get that courtesy. But yeah, we were chilling. We were waiting for people to leave. Until they didn't leave. So we just waited for another group to leave and they left. So we're not sitting. Now while we were waiting, we were hanging. Can you imagine us hanging? Ah, what nonsense. <laughs> It's the drama for me. The drama. Bang, bang. 
hapa Desina Desina you are Desina you got to get Desina wewe wewe It was good, it was nice. Um, they chilled very relaxed, nothing hectic. Maybe let me close this before it gives us feedback. I was worried that that window was gonna give us feedback, but yeah. So, catching up on some YouTube videos. <laughs> so ironic that yeah. Every every YouTuber watches YouTube. That's that's the beauty about it. Um, yeah, so we're just gonna normalize life now. Unpack some of the stuff that I need to unpack. I still have a lot of things that I didn't unpack. Um, so my clothes are just a bit everywhere. So just gonna do that. Been having coffee. Um, and a rusk, and then catching up on everything else. Um, healing streams were so proper yesterday. I caught up on like the um, a good part of it in the evening, and it was really so good. The the service, the so the healing school, the healing stream services. They get better with each and every iteration and I don't know man, it's like how the, the director of the healing school said that it just becomes better, it's, it's beca it becomes an ever increasing glory and yeah, so great, so so good to see, so good to experience and yeah, looking forward to the next one and my peeps from SA were representing, level singers, they were representing, looked so good, sounded absolutely amazing. I was actually watching one of the music demonstrations this morning. This morning we are doing a little bit of work, then it's off to the wine farms, off to the Stellan Bosch. We are going that side of town. And yeah, hope you guys are going to enjoy that. I'm going to make sure that I capture all of that and show you guys. So stay tuned. If you haven't subscribed, do the things. If you haven't liked, if you haven't commented, if you haven't shared with your friends, do the things. Check it out now.
So over the past couple of months, I've been using this charcoal pay mask from Skin Republic. You get it in this little sachet from from Clicks, and then you can use it like three or four times. I've been using this like every once or twice a month, I guess. Not, I don't use it often. I don't use it as often as I use this baby here. This baby here, I use every single day. Um, it's like about 200 rand, just, and it's it really lasts. Like it's a big one, yeah. So I've been using these. I've been using them for. I've been using them for a while now. Um, so that's how sometimes I really don't have problematic skin. I'm not gonna lie. I don't have problematic skin at all, which is probably why um, it's not. It doesn't take much for me. Which is probably why it doesn't really take much for me. So. Uh, also, I don't have. I also don't have like a lot of facial hair so that helps while I'm doing this I should actually really just talk about so uh, um, I was saying earlier <laughs> my my memory card my memory card gave in before I was able to finish what I was just saying but what I was basically saying is that self-care is is something that's been very popular and very yeah trendy in terms of us talking about it and saying oh I'm, this is self-care and people think that self-care is really just taking care of yourself and doing things that you like but sometimes self-care is not as cute as we think um, and especially when it comes to the guys gents don't do the necessary self-care that is required for them to live a healthy life mentally physically emotionally and what has been a big challenge in the past couple of years is that then the ladies who put in the work need to absorb that and not even just the ladies but the interpersonal relationships that males have become difficult because each person is not putting in the necessary work into getting themselves healthy getting themselves sound and getting themselves like overall okay you know so it's something i would really really encourage all of us as majita to focus on focus on our mental health focus on how we feel on our emotions our emotional health is important um, the past the present and the future be intentional about those particular things and because this is a vlog I'm not really going to go in depth with that and really bore you because I know that you guys don't want to listen to that but I thought it was something that I want to share and hopefully in the near future I will have more videos that are going to talk about this and really just communicate it and yeah so this thing so so on my way here i was reading this book i picked up this book by mike todd called crazy faith so i picked it up again to read it um i had started reading it a, a couple of months ago but then i stopped um i stopped because of when i do when i do the book review i'm gonna do a book review when i do the book review i'll tell you guys why i stopped <laughs> i'll tell you guys why i stopped reading it because there was a time i was reading it and then i was like <laughs> and like then i stopped i stopped reading it and then i'll let you guys know why but i'm just gonna be catching up on a couple of pages and i actually haven't spoken to my mom this morning I don't know where the girl is. Who is this? 
Wo ist sie da? So we are on our way to Coin. We're just gonna check out the wine from the restaurant was fully booked so taking a chance with the wine tasting and probably if there's if they have like an opening at the restaurant that maybe we can grab something to eat but then when we are done with that we'll probably go to uh, probably go to Simon Sech because they are fully booked so we we're making do you know we don't also wanna wrap ourselves or strap ourselves in terms of the in terms of the, the itinerary we just wanted to make sure that we're able to do as much as possible and we did not strap ourselves so yeah but we're checking us later oh my god we are so dark <laughs> So we just got to Coen um, and we are about to do the wine tasting. Um, it, 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 it's a really beautiful place. I like it. There are some things that I would change, but this is not about me. The one thing I can tell you is that South Africa has very beautiful places to go to. Sure, I'm sitting here and I'm looking at these mountains and these vineyards and I'm like, yes, this man. We just got to coin. Um, it's it's in Stellenbosch slash clips or something like that. Um, I'm not sure. Clip something. But absolutely beautiful place. Love the scenery. It's just very very hot. I actually want to check how hot it is because we are sweating. Uh, the network here is also not really great, so I'm struggling to post on Instagram. And yeah, there's that legendary place where everybody's taking pictures. Um, we want to go there, but the sun is so hot that we can't see what's so bright as well. That we can't really see what you want to do there, you know. So, thought I should come outside and just give you guys um, a quick brief because it is hectically noisy inside. There's a group um, that's sitting some close by. And you know how groups are. The moment you're in a group... The noise levels go up. I guess it's the same. I guess I'm also very noisy when I'm with my with my friends. Ooh. It's the land for me. So we're not gonna stay here for forever in a day. We're really gonna just chill a bit, have a little bit more. Do actually the actual wine tasting and then go to Simon's because as 
loyal followers of Simon Tsukh, we have to go home. <laughs> we have to go home to Simon Tsukh and then we can maybe chill there a little bit longer and then go back to Cape City. Go back to Cape City. Cool, check you guys later. Oh, this place is actually beautiful, guys. So that's about it for today's vlog. Please do make sure that you hit that like button as well as subscribe because part two is coming soon. Have a good one.